Wow, where do you think it leads? I don't know. Yeah, that's pretty deep. Yeah, don't get too close. Hey, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it! Ah, uh, really? Unbelievable. Ah, uh, sorry. You think they can get radio contact this deep? Well, they kind of knew where we were. I'm sure they'll be looking for us soon. Hey, wait. What's that? A tunnel. A tunnel? Probably just some old lava tube. Maybe we should check it out. Nope. Oh, what do you mean? Come on. Nope. Not doing it. I've seen this movie. The guy who goes down the creepy tunnel dies first. Hey, big wuss. I'm gonna stay right here and wait for help. Whatever, suit yourself. You're seriously going down there? Uh, yeah. You're nuts. So, when I find the treasure, you don't want any of it, right? Good. I didn't think you did. More like, what do you want me to write on your tombstone? Whatever. You're crazy. Come on, wuss, there's nothing down here. No, you go ahead. You're good. <sighs> Just a bunch of rocks. It's a lava tube. Right. How deep does this go? What the? Are you kidding me? No way! Seriously? Holy shit! Is this some sort of secret base? They didn't want anybody to see this? No way. It's too old. That looks way too old to be some sort of military base. Hey Bill, can you hear me? Hey Bill? Bill? Can you hear me? Uh, it's probably too deep. There's no... There's no way to get in. Or maybe this is just a wall. There's no way this is just a wall. It's way too... Oh wait. No, 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 no! Ah, damn it! Hello everyone, my name is Veos and welcome to another video. I hope you enjoyed that tiny little thing. It took like maybe two hours to make, but I really did it really fast. It was just basically to um, showcase what you could do with flags now that you can turn them into three-dimensional platforms. You can do all kinds of stuff now. You can do props, doors, well, no, you could always do doors, but you know, you could do like you could do like fantasy stuff, you can make alien inner, inside alien spacecraft, you can, I mean the the abilities are limitless, the possibilities are limitless. So 
yeah, this this could definitely do some awesome storytelling type of backgrounds, which would be an amazing thing. Um, I haven't done stories in a long time, and I know that a lot of people loved my Solar Nations series. It's unfortunate that I had to shut it down and or give it to somebody else. Regardless, I, I had to I had to let it go because it was taking up way too much of my time. Because it was it was literally and it wasn't the story that was taking up the time. It was the testing of the craft files. It was the the uh, endless um, error and trial and error of trying to make uh, something work compared to something that doesn't work or makes sense in an economical way since it was technically based off of the science career mode in KSP. Although I do kind of want to actually play the game with career mode, you know, dealing with money and contracts. I've never done that. In this entire time, I've never played their contract money kind of career mode where you start off with a basically a, a box with tin foil around it for your place of operations and then you upgrade over time. But anyway, I digress. So yeah, doing this, this whole flag thing, really cool. The whole 3D flag that they got going on for KSP 1.12. Lots of, uh, lots of potential there. A lot of potential. But anyway, it's really late and uh, I want to go ahead and get this ready for tomorrow. So I'm going to wish you guys all a wonderful day. Thank you so much for being a part of this channel and thank you so much for your support. You guys are amazing. Every time you like this video, every time you comment, every time you share this video, it, it's incredible the amount of support that this channel gets and I cannot thank you all enough from the bottom of my heart I love you all take care and I'll see you with another video tomorrow bye bye